Today I'm going to show you how to make the nicest, bestest, bestest non-milk milkshake ever and that's only a slight exaggeration. <laughs> this is the easiest thing ever and it is a guilt-free chocolate hit. So you'll need a Breville blender. Okay, that was not happening. This is why I don't do voiceovers. Honestly, any blender will do. I just love Blend Active. Then you want to lay out all your ingredients that you're going to need. So a full chopped banana, a teaspoon of peanut butter, and obviously this is the Snickers element of the smoothie. Also going to use a teaspoon of maca powder, which has a very, very malty flavoring. Optional is a teaspoon of cinnamon, which I really like. Also for the chocolate part, a scoop of non-dairy protein powder. I mix it up between soy protein powder and brown rice protein. For the liquids, you'll need a cup of whatever milk you like. I love almond milk for this. And it's always more fun, especially for kids and young teens, to serve it in a cute cup. I love this Jamie Oliver one, and I also love my Disney glasses. And it is literally as easy as you dump everything into your blender and a lot of people avoid making smoothies and shakes because they think it's time consuming or messy but that's just not the case. Especially with this one, it was a birthday present from my boyfriend and I am obsessed with it. One of the best things about this blender is that if you're in a rush in the morning for college or school or work, if you throw a load of stuff into this, once it's been made, you can actually drink it directly from the flask. Amazing! All that's left to do is pourry, pourry, pour. Oh god, it looks so good when you pour it. <laughs> I'm giving myself cravings right now. Totally gonna go and make one of these for a snack. They're perfect for breakfasts, for desserts. But yeah, leave me a comment with, you know, your favourite smoothie or shake recipe because I really love trying out new ones. And we can all learn a thing or two off each other in the comments section. I hope you've enjoyed, guys. Bye. Oh, it's fucking lovely. And these snack bars are to die for. I don't care what anyone says. People either seem to love or hate these, but they're like just raw fruit and nuts crushed together. And I just think they're incredible. The cocoa orange one is my favorite. Oftentimes I'll have a really small glass of juice or smoothie in a day. Never really more than like the 150 milliliter guideline just cause it is high in sugar, but I really like it. And then for lunch, I most often opt for a sandwich because they're just so nice.